Hello everyone, welcome back to Sim Airport. So last episode got some stuff done when it came to over here. It honestly, I think it looks really, really nice. I really like it. Um, it kind of pops out a little bit. Wasn't too sure about this color at first, but it's kind of growing on me. Um, so yeah, I like it. I do. Uh, found out in the last episode that uh, windows actually do impact the environment when it comes to this area around here. So I want to go ahead and add in some more real fast. So let's add in, let's go to windows and let me see if I go, let's get rid of that. Um, just go ahead and add in a six window there and I want it to be straight across from it. So we'll go another one there. And then if I do kind of something similar like I did over here, skip one and then go six, skip one and then go six. So that'll be good. That'll be good. Um, now, what I want to focus on today is I want to focus in on um, getting this kind of kind of finished up a little um, in the sense of being ready to go to accept flights. <clears throat> Now, lost my train of thought. There we go. Taxiway. <laughs> so first and foremost, need to get a taxiway in here. Need to be able to have the, uh, the flights connect up to these over here. And the next thing that we're going to need to do, we need to expand our baggage system. So right now, as it stands, we have, you know, this little underground walkway, which is actually really nice. I really like it. Um, we could have put this up top, but what I want to do up here is this, I want to be like our little fuel area. Um, I want this to be the area to where, you know, the, the trucks come in and the fuel gets put in here and the fuel then gets dispersed out to all of these and everything. That's, that's what I'm looking for, uh, when it comes to this, but that's not going to be this episode, this episode, I want to get the baggage taken care of. So if we go down here to the third level and we're looking at the baggage hub that's right here I should be able to just have my baggage depot here or should I have it no no I think I should have the baggage depot here uh, hang on what about the let's look at the hangers first so medium hanger can have three vehicles and can I get that in here? I can actually, I can put a medium hanger in this little area. So I'm almost wondering if it would be beneficial to put two of these in here. Like if I put one there and if I put one there and then the baggage hub could go right here in the middle, a large hanger gives me five could always just do a large one right here. I have to remember too that if I put fuel in, I'm going to need fuel trucks. Well, unless I upgrade these. Um, all right, let's look at the way this is. So that is there. So if I put this, say, here. Yeah, I'll put that there. Because that'll give me the ability to expand this taxiway if need be. Yeah. Yeah, that'll give me the ability to do that. And then I want to put my baggage hub right here. So my depot, I want to go right here. Which of course, I have to put a foundation underground for that to happen. So let's see. So foundation... And uh, crap, hang on. So uh, this thing is, I want to say that big. Is it that big? Is that how big it is? Let's go back to, let's see, baggage depot, depot. Oh, I was close. I was close. I need to shorten it by one. So if I clear that. So then if I go here to there, that's what, seven? So if I go down, and this is what I think is really neat. You can actually plan underground too. I love it. <laughs> I think it's great. 
So there's the seven there, and if I go down one more, my seven there. Okay, so that means I'm at least going to have... How did I do this one? How did I do... Where's the baggage depot at? Here it is. I have it a little bit bigger than... Okay. Okay, so if I go... Where are we at? So if I do a foundation underground like that. No. No, I think I want to do a foundation underground like that. Maybe go out one more. That's too far. Cancel project. Not what I want to do. Because I don't want to go... I don't want to go two past. I just want to go one past. Like that. And like that. Okay. Alright, let's try that. Let's see if that works. I mean, it should. It should work. While I'm waiting on them to build that out, let's go down to this ground level. Now, I should be able... I should be able to do just a hub to hub on that. No, no, I don't even need to do that. I don't. I don't need to do that. Let's let's do that as um What's this one? That's consumer, so that's a producer. So that'll have it go to the baggage hub. And then we'll go from the baggage hub into there. If that's the way they work out. I think it is. Let me go up. They've actually already got that built. These guys are building these things really fast. Um, no. Baggage, baggage, baggage depot. Okay. Alright, so now... Uh, see, the big question is... Which way do I put this? Let's just place it that way. Okay. This does not help me. <laughs> this does not help me. So do I just pick one? Does it automatically adjust to how I want it done? It doesn't look like it matters. It honestly does not look like it matters. One of them goes in one direction, the other goes in the other direction. So how do I have... how do I have this one? So I have it with a yellow on the bottom. Okay, so this is the same way. Yellow is on the bottom. Which means... That's the intake. Does it matter? I honestly do not think it matters. It it really doesn't. It doesn't. It does not matter which one of these gets hooked up to either spot. So it doesn't matter. Okay. All right. Well, good to know. I was worrying about all that crap for nothing. <laughs> Seriously. Urgh. Anyway. Um, all right. So let's get this built. So I want this basically to come straight out. And it has to be big enough to... To house both of these. Um, huh. So this is where it's going to cost us. But that's okay. We actually almost have a million dollars in the bank. Which is pretty awesome. So I think that's about how big we're looking to be. Is right there. So if I go construction foundation. And this is probably the worst part of this new update that they did. However, if your airport is big enough. Or if it's at least bringing in a decent amount of money, then doing something like this really isn't going to be all that bad. You know, yeah, it's going to be expensive, but, you know, we had almost a million dollars in the bank. And here we were able to afford 
well, we're going to be able to afford this entire thing without any issue whatsoever. Which is good. Which is really, really good. Uh, so then what I want to do next is we're going to take... Um, somehow, if I can remember what I'm freaking doing, I'm going to take this all the way down to here. Like that. Now, let's see, here I've got... This is where it always gets tricky. So you have to look at, so your conveyor. Oh, it does matter on here. Crappy. Oh, that is crappy. Well, that's no big deal, though. That's that's no big deal. <laughs> that's no big deal. Because we can take... The reason why I say it's no big deal is because we can change these. We can change them as needed. We can move one as a producer and the other as a consumer. It's no big deal at all. Which is actually the one thing that I really do like about the new update when it can when it came to when it comes to um, the baggage and everything. That update that they did for this is great. Having two-way conveyors and having the ability to change it and everything is awesome. Love that. Now, if we can just get the ability to change the escalator direction, that would be awesome too. Um, I. Uh, can I? Yes, I can switch the direction. Look at that. I, it can be done. So they did fix that bug to where we can switch this direction if uh, if we need to. So let me slow the game down real fast. And yeah, I don't really necessarily want to do it now. I wish I could change the direction on the escalator, though. Can't do that. Wish I could. I put the suggestion in to the developers. Not sure if they saw it. It was a tweet. Might have to go onto one of the forums. Probably do it there. It's probably going to be smart. Um, Alright, so next... Do we have this built yet? Let's go down. No, oh gosh, no. <laughs> We're not even close. Not even close to getting this built yet. So let's look at... So we'll clear that out. Which, of course, it's not going to clear out until that's done. Uh, planning, clear... Let's uh, increase the priority on that, shall we? Let's get that done first. It's going to take a minute. So the way I'm thinking that this is going to go is <clears throat> this conveyor is going to go... Hang on. Let me just plan this out now. All right, so this is going to be... This will come down this way. So this is going to come all the way down. And then it's going to have to come down this way. And then the yellow one is going to have to come down this way. Now the biggest question that I'm going to have to get this done, once I get this down here, come on, there we go, is going to be how are the up and downs going to work? So if I go up one, and if I'm looking at the conveyor, so this is going to be from the producer. So if this is from the producer, then this is going to end up being connected to the yellow line. And then this is going to be connected up to the magenta line. So that means I'm going to have to switch them around. So that means this is actually going to need to be the consumer and this is going to need to be the producer. Just the way this is going to hook up. Because the yellow is going to come down this way and hook up to this side, and then the magenta will come up and hook up to this side. It's actually not that bad. Pretty simple. Um, it'll be 
better once I can actually, you know, do it. <laughs> now, don't get me wrong, they're, they are building pretty quickly. So, um, but what I want to do while they're doing this, I need to figure out how this is going to go up and down. So if I go, I don't know why I want to keep going into the queue lines for this. This, no, that's wrong. So if I take both of those and go that way with it. And then if I go... I want to do a conveyor down. That's not what I wanted to do. So I can actually cancel that. I don't think I can have those butt up right up against each other though. So never mind. That does need to go like that. Let me go down one. Oh yeah, that's definitely not big enough. Okay, so I'm gonna have to make this bigger. Um, so that means let's go there, let's go there, let's do let's go out for eh, let's go out to there. I know I'm probably making this a little bit bigger than what it should. But that's okay, I like that. Bigger is better sometimes, at least in my opinion. <laughs> now, I will say that uh, there was a comment that was made, I don't remember who it was, but he said that he was gonna show me my, his airport, or her airport, I'm guessing it's a guy, I'm not entirely sure, but anyway. So they're going to show me their airport once we're done with this uh, second section over here. <laughs> so I, I think um, that'll be really interesting to see. And I actually already, um, believe it or not, have plans for the next series. Um, don't get me wrong, I'm not going to abandon this one. I'm learning a lot of mistakes from this one. Um, oh, why is this not working? Um, I'm definitely learning a lot from this, that's why, <laughs> from this. But the, the whole multi-level thing is completely different. You know, it's it's a completely new concept, and I thought it was going to be okay by having the, um, you know, the prefabricated thing there. It's not. It, it really isn't. Um, for those of you who have asked me how to do the multi-floors and everything else, and with, um, you know, with the builds that you have done, let me know, do you think it's better to have the prefabricated start off or start from scratch. My opinion, after doing this especially, start from scratch definitely seems to be the better way to go. That's just my opinion, that's what I think. All right, uh, conveyor down. I could go, I could go this way with it. Transition up. So if I go down one and put that there, that means this will need to hook up to that. And then if I go transition down, is that going to work? Is, am I going to be able to fit? I should be able to fit that. Should be able to fit that there with that there. Uh-huh. And then this will hook up to that. Absolutely brilliant and perfect. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Yeah, okay, I'm a little weird. Alright, I can't help it. <laughs> it's just the way I am. Oh, anyway. You should have seen me as a kid. I was very awkward. <laughs> which, I, I don't know. That's probably not a surprise to yeah, a lot of you. You know? Probably not. And I'm still awkward. I'm still, you know, that goofy, awkward person. You know, it's just, uh, it's just how I am. So, anyway, let's get all of this built in here. This is going to be so nice to get this done.
It's going to be so awesome. Uh, of course, that's not cleared out yet, so I'm going to have to get that cleared out. Do, 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 do. Goodbye. Um, and then while I'm waiting for that to be done, let's go ahead and clear off this. I said clear, not turn it yellow. <laughs> I didn't want to click on yellow. I wanted to clear it out. There we go. Um, and then actually I want to make that a priority. Oh my gosh. This is, this is great though. I love how this has turned out. I really do. And, and I think the reason why I love the way it's turned out so much is just because it's, yeah, it's kind of a pain in the butt to, to go in and build a foundation for the, um, for the baggage conveyors and the hubs and all of that kind of stuff, but it makes it a lot more fun. Yeah, it's challenging, but again, that's part of the fun is to have a game that's challenging. Whereas before you would just, you know, you would be on the ground level and you would just put a hub down like underneath the plane and connect to it. You know, it, it there wasn't, there wasn't that much of a challenge to it. But now, now there's definitely that challenge and, and I absolutely love it. Um, I'm going to assign this to, oh, can't do that yet. Okay. Let's go back down, waiting on this to be built. Okay, they've got that cleared out. So now we can go ahead and do utilities, conveyor. Oh, wow, that's being built all the way up to there. All right, so that should be a producer going into that, which I, I think is right. Yep, perfect. Absolutely perfect. Is there luggage on there already? There is. Look at that. Wow. Oh, all right. Hey, nothing wrong with that. Clear that out of there. Go back up. Clear that out. Perfect. Oh, I guess we can go ahead and clear that red out of there, too. And that. Might as well. Okay. So this we can go ahead and assign to there. This one I'm going to assign to... Why? Requires con connection from a baggage hub. Must be assigned to aircraft gate. So can I just unassign it to the... Yeah, okay. So I can't be assigned to two different ones. Interesting. Interesting. You cannot have one gate assigned to two baggage claims. I mean, it, okay, it makes sense, right? It totally makes sense on why that can't happen. <laughs> okay. All right. Sweet. That is a huge accomplishment for today. And we really didn't do... See, and again, this is the reason why... You know, a couple people have asked, why am I putting this down on the third level? Well, that's why. You know, this is why this is coming down here to this third level. So that I have the room to do this. Why is this not connected? Are we, are they still, it's not what I wanted. Wrong key. There we go. Now it's connected. Yay. We're good. And we have luggage being produced off of there. Sweet. <laughs> that makes me really happy. That's a really good accomplishment for today. I really like that. Um, so we still have a couple minutes left, right? So why don't we go ahead and start figuring up. Let's go up to the this level here. Ooh, 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 ooh. That's, that looks like trouble. Well, no, not really. Not really. I mean, there's a bunch of people still trying to get over there, but that's fine. Totally fine. Huh. 191 passengers and still an hour and a half to go. Granted, it's still waiting on baggage to be loaded. What's with the golf cart? Oh, crap. Hang on. So I need to add... A couple more baggage cars. Why is this not? Requires connection. Uh-oh. 
Uh oh. Oh. What did we break? Is it saying it's not connected? Oh, it's not connected. Ha ha, look at that. We are missing a piece. We are missing a piece to the puzzle. And we found the missing piece. And there we go. Boom. Done. I'm sure some of you were probably yelling at me. I almost guarantee you some of you were probably sitting there watching this going, you're missing a piece. You're missing a piece. You need to fix the piece. You need to fix the piece. I'm just saying. You were probably saying it. Now, if I can get this guy to hurry up and build it, thank you. Now we are active. Now we are good to go. <laughs> Let's go back up. Okay. Oi. Can, can we have... Oh, it delayed it. All right. We're going to force departure on this one. Dang it. Me and my silly screw-ups. Silly, silly screw-ups. Oh, well. That's okay. Well, that pretty much took up the rest of our time. <laughs> uh, I think, uh, yeah, I think we're good. Um, no, we're not. We're not good. Get rid of a couple more things on here. So let's get rid of that. And then let's get rid of this. Now, it's very possible that... I might have to redo a little bit of this right here, but I don't know. Again, golf cart guy is stuck. Again. <laughs> He's stuck again. Hopefully he'll go away by the time we uh, get to the next episode, but we'll see. We'll see what happens. I don't know. I Here's what we'll do. Next episode, probably focus on finishing this up. I want to get to fuel at some point. I want to get to... Um, expanding. I want to get that expansion done over there. Not sure if I want to expand this way. I don't think so. No, I have to. I have to expand this way because I need a longer runway in order to get the extra large gates. If I remember correctly, I think we can only expand like 10 times. I think 10 is the limit and we've already expanded what once this way? And once that way, <laughs> so we actually have a lot more expansion that we can do. <laughs> Love it. Oh, God. Okay, you know what? I'm done. I'm getting a little slap happy now doing this. <laughs> okay. So, yeah, that's all I have. Again, as always, questions, comments, concerns, put them down in the comment section below. I will address them as I can. Yeah, that's, uh, that's about it. That's all I got. <laughs> I'm done. I, I can't talk anymore. I'm so done. <laughs> oh, God. Okay. So, yeah, that's it. Thank you for watching, everyone. I'll see you next time. <laughs>